He is known for being associated with atomism, the theory that everything is composed of imperishable atoms and void. He is recognized for his contributions to the invention of atomism, credited by Aristotle and Theophrastus. His name is Leucippus. In the ancient world of Greek philosophy, there was a brilliant thinker named Leucippus. He is often associated with the groundbreaking concept of atomism, which states that the universe is composed of imperishable and indivisible elements called atoms, along with empty space known as void. Determining the exact contributions of Leucippus and his contemporary Democritus to atomism has proven to be a challenging task, as their ideas were closely intertwined. Aristotle, the renowned philosopher, and his student Theophrastus, explicitly credit Leucippus with the invention of atomism. Leucippus agreed with the Eleatic argument, put forth by thinkers like Parmenides, that, true being does not admit a vacuum. He believed that without empty space, movement would be impossible. Leucippus argued that since movement undeniably exists, there must be empty space that allows for it. However, Leucippus also grappled with the concept of void, ultimately concluding that it is synonymous with non-being. He recognized that, nothing, cannot truly exist. This distinction between being and non-being set Leucippus apart from the Eleatics, who often blurred the line between the two. Plato further emphasized this distinction, highlighting the varying degrees of existence and types of negation. Leucippus' ideas on atomism and the existence of void left a lasting impact on ancient Greek philosophy. His willingness to explore the concept of non-being and the interconnectedness of atoms and empty space laid the foundation for future philosophical debates. Leucippus was a pioneering figure, pushing the boundaries of understanding and leaving a philosophical legacy that continues to captivate thinkers and learners to this day. Leucippus, a figure shrouded in controversy, found himself at the center of a philosophical debate that raged on for years. Epicurus, the philosophical heir of Democritus, claimed that Leucippus never existed, casting doubt on the very existence of the man himself. However, the weight of Epicurus' word was countered by the evidence presented by Aristotle, who attributed the framework of atomism to Leucippus. It seemed that Leucippus did exist, but the question remained as to whether he was truly a philosopher. Amidst this uncertainty, fragments and doxographical reports about Leucippus were collected by Hermann Diels, a prominent scholar in the field. His work sought to shed light on the enigmatic figure, gathering evidence to support the notion of a historical Leucippus. The existence of these fragments gave further credibility to the belief that Leucippus was more than just a myth. While the controversy raged on, Leucippus' philosophy of atomism continued to captivate the minds of scholars and thinkers alike. His ideas, which formed the foundation of atomistic theory, challenged traditional beliefs and offered a new way of understanding the world. The notion that everything is made up of tiny, indivisible particles resonated with many, providing a framework for explaining the complexities of the universe. Leucippus' philosophy, though rooted in ancient times, still holds relevance in our daily lives. His emphasis on the fundamental building blocks of existence reminds us to pay attention to the smallest details and appreciate the interconnectedness of all things. Just as atoms come together to form matter, our actions and choices shape the world around us. Leucippus' teachings encourage us to consider the impact of our decisions and recognize the power we hold in shaping our own lives. Do you want to explore more philosophers? Who do you want to see featured next? Subscribe and leave a comment below to let me know. I'll see you in the next video.